Hello everyone and welcome to the developing keywords video for keyword searching. In this video we're going to talk about some ways that you can develop more keywords from your initial search. One thing that students often misunderstand about research is that it's not a simple linear process. It's more about exploring and experimenting trying out different words and different combinations of searches until you are left with the most and best sources that you can find. Part of that means that as you go, you may have to shift your keywords or your search strategy. We're going to focus right now on just how can you develop more keywords if you've already started with a few. In this regard, you can generate more keywords by thinking about synonyms and related terms. Synonyms are words that are restating the same idea, but slightly different. For example, if I were doing research on American Indians, the keyword Native Americans is another way of saying that same population. That would be a synonym. A related term is a connected idea or topic that may not be identical to your keyword, but is strongly connected to it. For example, if I'm doing research on endangered species, then the ideas of deforestation, meaning the loss of forest or habitats for endangered species, and poaching or the illegal hunting of endangered species, are not the exact same thing as endangered species, but they're clearly related and could help me find more information. You can generate both synonyms and related terms in a couple of ways. The first way is to actually look at your sources you're already finding. It's very common that you are joining a conversation already in progress. So people who are already studying what you're researching may have different words that they use. It might be more technical, it might be a form of jargon, meaning it's a very specific word to the profession or the group. And we can find different keywords in several fields. When I look in the title field, I see sanitation is there and health is there, which are already the keywords I have. But if I look in the subject field, then I can see that I have different things. Sanitary engineering, it would be concerned with maintaining sanitation. So that would be a related term. Public health is a more specific kind of health that's being looked at. So that could be a synonym for health. Communicable diseases, disease outbreaks, water pollution might be related terms because sanitation involves clean water. You can also look in the summary and the contents note in the library catalog or in the abstract if you're using one of the article databases. The summary, contents, and abstract all give you an idea of what's in these sources, a little bit of a summary. So in my summary it mentions that water availability, water quality, and sanitation are fundamental issues underlying infectious disease emergence. Well infectious disease then might be a related term. It goes on to say that connections between water, sanitation, and health and etc. are discussed. So any of these water related disease, sanitation infrastructure, these could be additional keywords for me. My contents don't have too many, but one thing that it does have is further information like infrastructure or waterborne disease. So I'm kind of picking my focus as I'm picking my new keywords. This is something you can do with as many sources as you continue to find and then experiment and see what else is out there. Another thing you can do is to brainstorm just what you know about a topic. If I'm looking at sanitation and health, which is what I chose, then there are some very real things happening right now that might be of interest to me. 
a synonym for sanitation might be hand washing. Or is it hand washing with a space in between? I don't know. I might need to try both to see which keyword yields better results. Just like public health is another synonym, I could do some other health. Maybe I want to look at prenatal health. Maybe I want to look at rural health. These are some different synonyms. Now, thinking of related terms, when I'm looking at sanitation, one of the things that comes to my mind is actually people who clean, janitorial staff or cleaning staff. Because I help out the nursing college a lot, another thing that comes to mind is hospital-acquired infection. That's not directly related to sanitation, but sanitation helps to cut down on hospital-acquired infection. Another related term might be um, safety of patients, because I'm thinking now in more of a medical context. I hope that this video is helpful to you as you develop more keywords, and I will see you in the next video.